Greetings, this is Spec Ops 56 and my faithful cameraman John Toe coming to you from Combat Information Central, otherwise known as my office. Today we're doing a truly epic unboxing. This is the box of prizes that I won from the giveaway done by the artist formerly known as Van Prepper, now known as VP Prepping and Survival. I'm a little late in getting this unboxing done. Uh, it came in a couple of weeks ago, but I've just been so busy with other things. Uh, John's been busy, so I didn't have my cameraman available till now. So um, I apologize for it uh, being so late, but uh, without further ado, Let's get into the goodies. Now, this has got to be probably the best unboxing <laughs> that I've, uh, prizes that I've won yet. And just, uh, I mean, uh, it, it, it's amazing. Van Prepper, uh, you know, I'm amazed. I look at this and see the postage on this, and the postage is $28.85. So he's, he's got even you know that much just in postage to get it to me so you know van prepper yeah <laughs> all right first we need to get the official zombie unboxing knife now let's get to work early christmas Bubble wrap! I got bubble wrap! Hey! I always wanted some bubble wrap. Yeah. <laughs> and papers. Okay, right. now we're getting down to the nitty gritty. Holy cow! You want to look? Take a look at this. Holy cow! Somebody's going to have a good Christmas besides me. Alright, let's see. Looks like we got a... Ah, uh, yes, we have a note here. Let me check this out. It's from VP Prepping and Survival with his cool new logo. It says Spec Ops 56. That would be me. Congratulations on winning second prize. And this is just second prize now. <laughs> wow. Okay. Congratulations on winning second prize in my 10K subscriber giveaway. Thank you for your support of my channel and all you do here in the YouTube small channel community. Well, 10K man prepper, you're getting to be a little bit more than small. <laughs> Enjoy the prize pack and have a great Christmas and New Year. VP Prepping and Survival. I certainly will. Okay, let's start here first. And John, you'll have to uh, do the, the zooming in and out. We have a cool patch, stick on patch. There, let's see, and it looks like we have a plastic waterproof match holder, Coleman. These are very useful, and this sounds like it might actually have some matches in it or something. That's always useful. Let's see, we have hand warmers 
Well, we haven't needed these lately, but uh, I suspect that as the winter goes on, we will. Okay, what else we got here? And something we all need to have, a pocket constitution and declaration of independence. Okay, we've got jute twine. Free pack of jute twine. That always comes in handy. Uh, you can see a little roll like this being perfect for a get home bag. prepared the prepper's vault. I agree, you should always be prepared. Alright. Oh hell. <laughs> Check this out. Oh man. This is a okay. Maybe there we go. Stiff needs a little oil, but this is a cool little knife. Wow. Not sure what the make is on it, but uh, I'll hold it there and you get a good close-up of it, John. You got it? Got it. Okay. That is very nice. Very nice. Okay. It's going to take a while. We've got a survival reflective tent. That's pretty cool. That's perfect in a, in a get home or a bug out bag. Let's see. Try to get this stuff where it's most of it is. Sort of, sort of visible anyway. I haven't even got to the big stuff yet. We have Eco Forest, 20 fire starters, more useful stuff. Okay, all right. Let's see. And now this is nice. An Adventure Medical Kits, first aid 2.0 kit. This is nice. This I, I can definitely use. I've been wanting to get get another good good medical kit. And this has all kinds of good stuff in it. And room for more. To add whatever you need to add. And it just keeps getting better and better. Okay. A nice Brunton compass. So when you're bugging out, you know where you're going. <laughs> a squeeze water filtration system. Man, they got about all about all the uh, bug out bases covered here. That's incredible. this. This looks handmade. Not exactly sure what goes in there. I guess uh, you could put a pocket watch or you could put a put a compass. But uh, this is really nice quality leather. Obviously handmade, hand stitched. Cool. Oh, got another one. Infidel. That's me. Definitely an infidel. Alright, what else we got? Pocket juice. Portable charger. 
Van Prepper, you just saved me some money. I was fixing real soon to order me one of these. <laughs> now I don't have to. So that's a few dollars I can spend for Christmas presents for somebody else. Beautiful. And we got a pouch. A Molly, or, well not necessarily Molly, but we got a nice belt pouch here. Utility pouch. Cool. Fox mesh organizer pouch is what it says. You can always use something like that. Man, I had I hadn't even gotten near the bottom of the box yet. We got a sterno folding stove. These are handy. Oh, oh. Got a selfie stick. John will be getting this one. Because uh, I had already gotten me a selfie stick some time back, haven't used it yet. There. Yeah, John will be getting some of this stuff. Assuming he's nice to me. I'll be nice. Not doesn't get on my naughty list. <laughs> okay, this is interesting. What is this? A fire puck. Matchless fire starter. Now this is something new to me. But uh, We'll have to give that a, do a test video on this sometime next year. And, man, you really loaded me up, Van Prepper. A titanium camillus, titanium stainless steel full tang drop point fixed blade. Wow. That is nice. That is amazing. Man, Christmas really did come early. And this looks like one of those, um, one of those uh, permanent matches. So that's always a handy little thing. And I'll use it to light my puck. Okay, one guy. Oh. We got another fire puck. Oh, Ozark Trail. A multi tool. All right. Can always use a good multi tool. This might, this will probably go in one of my, one of my get home bags. Got sunblock with insect repellent spray pump. Now, as you look at me, you can see that this sunblock is something I most definitely can use. <laughs> you know, when I said epic unboxing, I didn't know the half of it. I thought this was going to be a quick video. <laughs> Alright, this is aluminum and stainless steel from the Visual Artisan, Rebecca Johnston. And it looks like, uh, yeah, okay, it's a chain with some snap hooks on it. Not exactly sure what you call it what the official name is, but I suspect I'll find a use for it. And in fact, we've got a couple more. Okay, we're starting to get down here. And right, now we're getting to the food. So I can, some of these will be showing up on food reviews next year. You can bet on that. 
We got Legacy Premium Macaroni and Cheese. Man, that's a lot of it here. Man, this is this is enough for several people. Pouch makes six prepared cups. Wow. Okay. And we have more food. Valley food storage, 25 year shelf life. Southern style chicken and rice. Well, I'm Southern. I like Southern style chicken and rice. Irish pub style cheddar potato. Seen a couple of reviews on the this one so far, and they all seem to seem to uh, give it favorable reviews. We've got the pasta primavera. Okay, and we've got the white bean and lime chili. That sounds interesting. <laughs> We got more bubble wrap. We got a we got a card. I think we may have reached the bottom. Yep. All right. Now this is what an epic unboxing looks like. Van Prepper, man, I can't say thank you enough. You really made my Christmas this year. And I think you probably made uh, some of John's Christmas this year, too, because I see him over there behind the camera grinning. He knows he's getting some of those goodies. <laughs> so, this is my epic unboxing. And I just want to say thank you, and thank you to everybody that watches. And I want to say, everybody, have a merry, merry Christmas and the best new year you can possibly have. This is Spec Ops 56 and my good friend John saying see you next year.